I'm Grant Archibald and I'm the Chief Executive of NHS Tayside. I wanted to take a few moments of your time to explain how the Board is responding to the challenge of COVID-19, which the country is facing at the moment. I think the key thing that I wanted to explain to you is that we have put in arrangements through our emergency planning programme to address the challenges that will come as coronavirus becomes more prevalent amongst our population. Those arrangements will allow us to make swift and good decisions to allow us to best manage the challenges which will come. And I am confident the team that we have working in that area will ensure that the response in NHS Tayside meets the needs of the public. One of the key things I wanted to explain that as part of that response, we've had to make a series of decisions and I wanted to explain why we'd made them. The first thing is we have made the decision to postpone all elective, that is non-emergency surgery, for all patients. Any patients who are expecting their surgery will be contacted and advised when they will receive their care later in the year. The second thing is we have made the difficult decision to suspend all visiting to all of our hospitals. And the reason we have made that decision is we want to reduce to the minimum the number of people who have to come into our hospitals and by doing so protect the spread of coronavirus and our most vulnerable patients. I hope everyone will understand that. There shall be some exceptions such as people accompanying their partners who are due to give birth but we would encourage anyone who has concerns about this decision to contact the charge nurse or the senior nurse in charge of the department or the ward where their relative is. As I say, this step has been taken in order to ensure the best interests of our most unwell patients and I hope everyone will understand the reason for it. We are going to have a number of these communications with you to keep you fully appraised of what we are doing. I would want to encourage everyone that there is a hard-working, committed team of professionals working entirely across the health and social services spectrum, absolutely committed to dealing with this unprecedented challenge. As we take this forward and as we respond to the challenge that is posed, I will keep you updated in respect of what we are doing in NHS Dayside. At the moment, I would just wish everybody in the community to know how proud I am of the response so far by all the staff that work for us and with us and our commitment to continue that in the coming days and months.